Today I'm going to report on the second day of the CBA 11 conference. Uh, we had uh, a number of different kinds of sessions, including discussions on ex sharing experiences. We had a, a poster session where everybody that brought a poster was given a couple of minutes to present it, and then people were allowed to go around the posters and ask questions. It was very interesting and, and very positive feedback from that. We also had prizes for the best posters. Uh, then we had another session, a parallel session on videos, where people presented videos on work they'd done and then talked about those videos and discussed how uh, we could improve on uh, using videos as means of communication. And then we also had some game playing as well by our friends from the Red Cross who also brought us some very novel food items to link up. So they are very good at engaging people in different and novel ways to engage with an issue which sometimes sounds very esoteric or very scientific or very difficult to understand. We use all kinds of jargon words in the scientific community which often uh, ordinary people have difficulty understanding to and relating to. So a large part of what we need to do more effectively is communicate better the messages that we are trying to come out with. And we try and experiment with different methodologies and modalities from playing games to showing videos to having all kinds of different kinds of discussions and networking. Um, not everything works as effectively, but we try things to see what is uh, worth pursuing and improving on. And so communications is a major element of our work, and today was a, a variety of different ways of communicating the science to a much wider audience. Uh, tomorrow we will have another a number of sessions. We will be talking about the, NAP, uh, the National Adaptation Planning Process. This is a joint program with the UN Framework Convention on Climate Change. And then day after tomorrow we will have our final closing ceremony.